Hey guys, Kyle Sutton here with your Pittsburgh neighbor, and today I am here with Dr. Cody Jordan, and I'm going to tell you all, or have him tell you all about his new book, Beyond Symptoms. We'll be back right after this. Dr. Cody, thanks for having me. <laughs> Absolutely, man. Yeah, very Pleasure cool. Um, I, I'm excited to get into to your book here to um, to figure out why you wrote it and what it's all about. But um, could, could you just tell tell our audience a little bit about uh, about who you are? Yeah, absolutely. So, Dr. Cody Jordan, my professional training is that of a corrective care chiropractor. Okay. Um, as far as the book itself, beyond symptoms, it's mm -hmm. it's come from multiple different avenues. Sure. I have a 16 and a half year in the Air Force very good. as of now. Yeah. And that's played a large part of it. Okay. But um, as far as who I am, I am a father of two wonderful, beautiful girls, six yeah. and four years old. I am a husband of my wife, Amanda, sure. and professional speaker, doctor of chiropractor, and ultimately now I'm an author. Very good. Very good. Yeah, you've, uh, you're, you're growing, man. Continue. That's beautiful. <laughs> that's beautiful. So um, beyond symptoms, what, uh, what, what kind of gave you the urge to write this book? Yeah, absolutely. So yeah. it's been my experience, and I don't think anybody would argue this, but we are definitely in a health crisis. Here in America, mm -hmm. we have more symptoms, we have more diagnoses, we have more disease than ever before. And I just think the quality of life is, is heading in the wrong direction. Sure, sure. So really the point of the book, Beyond Symptoms, is it's kind of a, it's addressing the problem with our health crisis. Our okay. medical system is very flawed. Yeah. And I think the biggest problem that we have is we're chasing symptoms. Okay. And as we, as we chase these symptoms, it's leading us down this rabbit hole. Mm -hmm. And there are thousands upon thousands of people out there who are suffering. They've been through the ringer. They've tried anything and everything to no avail. Mm -hmm. They're not getting the results they're after. In fact, they're not even getting any answers. Okay. So the point of the book is it's a two-part book. Yeah. The first part of it, it's going to address why we're in a health crisis, the flaw mm -hmm. in our healthcare system. And then ultimately, the second part of the book is more the how-to. How can you take your okay. health into your own hands and how can you lead into a lifestyle that's going to allow for you to enjoy a good quality of life? Okay, so it's a uh, how do we get here now? Now how do how do you get out of here? Here in some essential. That's exactly what it is. Very yes. good. Okay. Okay. Um, so it's we we've been chasing symptoms. What um, I, I know uh, it's a good sized book, so we we can't get through through all of it. But what would be some take homes for somebody who who even might just see this and before they want to order your book, haven't got it yet. Where, where does somebody start? Absolutely. Yeah. So the book itself is really for anybody who's looking for that competitive edge. And let's okay. face it, everybody wants their kids to be the best they can be. Mm -hmm. So really the biggest takeaway from the first part of that book is if you do in fact want to be healthy, mm -hmm. you have to understand what it means to be healthy. Okay. Here in America, we've allowed ourselves to, to put our own little spin on what it means to be healthy. And if, mm. if I were to ask, hey, what does it mean to be healthy? Typically, if I ask 10 different people, I get 10 different answers. Yeah, that makes sense. Right. And a lot right. of people, what they're gonna do is they're gonna say, I'm healthy if I look good, if I feel good, if I work out, if I don't have symptoms, mm -hmm. if I do yoga, if I don't take medications. And I get all these different answers, and none of them are bad. Sure. But the reality is you can't be something you don't understand. So start by understanding what health is. Health, according to the World Health Organization, is the optimal function of your body. Mm -hmm. So if you want to be healthy, your body needs to function the way it was designed to. Okay, okay. So if, if we can understand that, then great. Mm -hmm. Now we can understand that stress attacks the weakest part of the body. Mm -hmm. That's a big deal because the American lifestyle it's stressful. Sure, sure. It's not going anywhere. You will be stressed for the rest of your life, whether okay. you're a child or whether you're at your elderly years and you're trying to enjoy. Mm -hmm. So how do we handle this stress? Exactly, okay. exactly. So what further question do you have on that? Yeah, um, well, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's got me thinking. Um, okay, if I am stressed, what would you say, gosh, Kyle, we, we, we're going to start you down this road, but today when you go home, I want you to start thinking about X. What, 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 what would that be? Kyle, my man, you're yeah. asking the right question. That's okay, perfect. good, good, good. So yes, if I am stressed, how do I handle this? You got two options. Uh -huh. Number one, you can try to manage your stress, but like I said, your stress isn't going anywhere. Sure. So unless you're doing yoga or meditating 24-7, sure. 
stress is going to get the best of you. Right. So if you can understand how the body works and you understand that stress attacks the weakest part of the body, mm -hmm. wouldn't it make sense to find out where am I weak? Where am I vulnerable? Okay. And okay. the problem is most Americans, they have no idea where they're weak or where they're vulnerable. Sure, sure. Mm -hmm. So really, and this is kind of what the book jumps into, you can tell a lot about somebody's health based on their posture. Interesting. And if you have any type of postural distortions, any shifts, any subluxations, that's a weakness. That's a vulnerability. Okay. So a lot of people don't understand health is the optimal function of your body. The next question we need to ask ourselves is what controls every single function of the body? What would you say, Kyle? Oh, gosh. What, what controls it? Uh, well, I'm going to say... Because I know know a little bit about you, <laughs> maybe it's it, it is going to be your 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 spinal health. Are we? Is that where we're going? So here's what's cool. Yeah. We work with a ton of kids in my uh -huh. office. Kids are awesome because they understand this better than adults. Okay. Us adults, we're corrupted. Sure. We've been taught and trained to base our health on how we look and how we feel. Uh huh. And the problem is the top three killers in America. You don't see them. You don't feel them until it's too late. Oh, interesting. Right. So anyway, health optimal function of your body, your brain mm -hmm. controls every single function of your body. Sure, okay. So how it does it is it sends life energy through your spinal cord. Your spine is like a river. It takes the energy from the brain through the spine. Connects the rest of your body there. Yeah. And then out the peripheral nerves to all your vital organs, all your major muscles, all your glands, every single cell in your body. It okay. needs that energy to function the way it's designed to. Sure, sure. Does that make sense? I think so, yeah. So if somebody has poor posture, they have postural distortions, if they can address that, mm -hmm. they can strengthen their vulnerabilities, those organs that those nerves are sending that life energy to, mm -hmm. they're going to function the way they're designed to. And those symptoms are going, bye-bye. Okay. Well, good. That, that could be encouraging, I think, right? Absolutely. Yeah, yes. very good. Very good. Okay. Well, well guys, Beyond Symptoms is the book. Um, people could get it on Amazon? Absolutely. Amazon. All right. So we'll, we'll put all those notes in here so that you can connect with it. And, and Dr. Jo Cody Jordan. Um, We'll connect you with him as well. Uh, th thanks for having me out today. No, I appreciate it. Kyle, the last thing I'll say about Please, this, because yes. it actually is really cool. Beyond Symptoms, it's a great read. It's an easy read. Mm -hmm. um, if you go on my website, it's yeah. called Inspired to Be Healthy. Okay. InspiredToBeHealthy.com. Mm -hmm. There are actually 10 application exercises. Excellent. Totally free Love it. to oh. download. So whether you get the book or not, you mm -hmm. download those. It's going to get you thinking in a completely different mindset. And, and these are steps you can take at, at home. Absolutely. Beautiful. Beautiful. Thank you, sir. Absolutely. All right. Take care, guys. We will um, check in with you again soon. Again, this was Kyle Sutton with Dr. Cody Jordan. The book is Beyond Symptoms. The show is your Pittsburgh neighbor, and I really appreciate you watching. Take care, everybody.